Okay, so now I've replayed this whole shit. Sorry, but yes, on a new um, profile and on advanced instead of casual because someone said that that helps. And if this does not work now, I'm not playing the game again because some people said uninstall and reinstall it, and I'm like, no. Okay, thank you. So obviously if you play it on casual, it just shits you in the face. So okay, let's go on. Under the Pyramids by Houdini and H.P. Lovecraft. Under the Pyramids? What's the significance of this story that was written two years be before Houdini's death? There's one of those. Interesting reading. Apparently Houdini told the tall tale to H.P. Lovecraft who wrote it as if it were true. God, stop talking. The story is about Houdini being kidnapped and put in a deep pit. He escapes to find that he is in the ceremonial cavern of an evil pharaoh and his minions of mummies. The giant paw of a great guardian beast is found in the cavern. Houdini later confessed that the, stories was not, that the story was not true. It was a vivid dream he had. Hello. True medium for the spiritualist movement. What does a fraud have to offer? Houdini would not speak to me, but I am not a fraud. I took a shortcut for the greater good. Mediums generally don't work for free. My mission was to show that Houdini could be contacted from the beyond and deliver a longer message from Houdini to the world that described the existence of an afterlife. Uh huh. Mediums usually don't work for free. Arthur Conan Doyle sent me on this mission because of my gifts and our common spiritualist movement views. My prize was Bess's $10,000 reward and the satisfaction of furthering the case. Doyle and I share a common view of the afterlife, and he couldn't resist using a person who shared his first name to be the messenger so he could leave a personal mark. Are you here to help me? I think Ford and Doyle suspect who may be the villain or villains in the plot to kill Houdini. The first suspect is being served up. Queen of Wands. Shit. Wow, that really scared me this time. Oh, hello. The Queen of Wands. I fancied myself as her. Dominant, enthusiastic, direct, warm, spontaneous, creative, popular, and confident. Hardly the profile of a murderer, don't you think? Mina is the queen of wands. She may not be the murderer, but her profile fits one of the extroverted front of the extroverted front person for the mastermind. I'm here for a reason. There are rooms to explore for clues. Oh, what? These rooms? Holy crud game. Alright. No. And under the pyramid symbol I need to find something that fits the shape to get the door open. How lovely. Go to this door. What else? In here? Oh. Safe code's been rearranged. I need to press the starting button and follow the instructions until I end at the handle. Mmm, it's a little hard. Oh, there. Alright. Two, right, four, down. One, two, three, four, three. Left, two, up, two, right, two, up. Three down, one left, one up, two right, one up, two down, three left, one up, one down, right, 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 right. Okay. Close it up. Copper? Why such a fuss to lock up what was a cheap piece of metal in that time? Unless interest was to hide a murder weapon. Arsenic was used to extract the metal from ore. Alright, crystal. Oh, of course. 
I mean, why not? Like I have those card things. All right. Doyle and Arthur Ford belonged to a mainstream branch of the spiritualist movement. Ford was a real medium who was hired by Doyle to obtain the Rosabel Believe code so they could spread their own message to the world as if it came from Houdini's spirit. They took shortcuts to suit their own agenda, but had no violent intentions. I think Doyle and Ford knew there were potentially deadly villains within their movement. They intend to help me solve this case. There is no doubt that I must pursue the first suspect. Alright, hint me. What? Oh. Alright. Look functional. was just a scene. Yeah, I'm... Cranston, I am very... A Harvard Medical School ring. It would interest me if a close relation to me is a doctor. Right now, I'm just partly hating this game, so I'm not really actually in the mood, and I should really go to bed, because... Yeah, I don't know. It's a shit now. Knight of Swords, Five of Swords, King of Swords. Swords. These are the cards of volatile personalities. There's a detailed log of someone's coming and going for three months. Can I presume it was Houdini? Houdini's mother. Maybe someone was planning to contact her. Where are you, stopwatch? Oh, of course, there you are. And Brand. Right. Oh, hello, Mina. You should use my services. I never accept money. The King of Swords is intellectual, clever, shrewd, cunning. But reversed, this person is prejudiced, manipulative, and enjoys com combative situations. Much like Mr. Houdini's combative quest to debunk mediums like myself. This is one of the minor cards, so you are dealing with one who takes orders. Beware of this person because they have a destructive anger and violent temper. This person glorifies violence and would see a murderous action as a virtue or a means to an end. No one is appearing. I expected to see Whitehead or Mina's brother Walter. Yeah, I swear to see Walter. Some lackey may have done the dirty work and murdered Houdini, but someone else gave the order. Knight of Swords is an ace problem solver, creative, direct, intense, logical, committed, but with a fiery passion and anger. The card was once reversed where, where it was malicious, vengeful, and willing to fight in the cool, skillful manner of a tactician. Something caused the card to revert back to its upright position. Oh, we're back here. Oh, yeah, I was thinking about that fog. The fog is lifted over the marshes. That's good. Seems like a good place to nose around. But we're not gonna do that now because I'm tired of this and I really have to sleep because I'm going to die either otherwise, basically. If Houdini was the target and Doyle was no more than a di diversion, the real villains are yet to be revealed. Who is the Five of Swords who did the deed? And more importantly, who was the mastermind? A tarot card is missing. But we're gonna do that another day. 
I'm just gonna take that. So I'm stopping here and going to bed and yeah, I'm not gonna get much sleep, but yeah. Okay, um this was I don't know random episode. Yeah. Shitty game, but Alright, um, yeah, I'm sorry, I'm not really in the mood right now, but, mm, that's what you get. It's okay, but, um, yeah, thank you guys for watching anyhow, um, and, um, yeah, I'll see you around.